What's going on, everybody? This is Super Robot and today we have in front of you Transformers Legacy United Wave 1 official picks and pre-orders. A lot of these were from the Hasbro PulseCon. But what's the point of getting those pictures when you have these nice, crispy, clear looking ones? This is going to be a long video because there's a lot of pictures. We're going to keep it short. Um, some we've already seen. Some things are new. Let's get into it. I didn't think I was going to make a video today, but I said I'll go ahead and make one anyway. All right, let's start it off. We got Hot Shot. We've seen him. Um, very, very, very nice looking. This is the Power Links version, or in Japan, Hot Rod S. Um, he is the correct colors. They actually, I think they borrowed some from the Japanese colors. This is some slightly different colors, but in the Japanese version, he had a light up hand for the original uh, Micron Legend Hot Rod S. Um, but you can see here, he looks good. I think Hotshot is a surprisingly great figure. I, in this mold, and the way they did it, it looks really good. Um, there's the car mode, you know, basically he's supposed to be Hot Rod. Those are supposed to be like going from Bumblebee to Hot Rod. And those guns are pretty nice. So the fact that we have the Minicon Jolt, I wish they would go ahead and make a pack of Minicons. That would be really nice for the ones we have, you know, especially Armada Prime. And there he is in the packaging. And next is this little tiny little Megatron who used to be oversized in America and Voyager sized in Japan. And I gotta admit, I know he's small. Boy, he looked good. I really wish they could have made him larger. Who knows? But yeah, he looks good. He's he's, he's small, Mike, you know, uh, legend size. Um, so yeah, I mean, he does good details. The wings, though, I wish they had went with a different kind of maybe clear, but it is what it is. Um, the weapons kind of plug in in the front. You know, the transformation looks a little different than the original, but he does have the. Uh, well, I think it's, it, it just flexes at one point. Or does it flex at two points? Can't really tell. He's got the tank sword weapon. And yes, he does look good. Might pick him up. Next is Tasmanian Kid. If you watch Beast Wars Second, you know, you know who this guy is. If not, he was, I think, Snarl uh, in the American version. I think. I can't remember. Um, but yeah, um, he looks good. I, I, I dig it. I dig it. I like I like what they're doing, but no, nah, that's more like a sword. <laughs> it looks weird on his arm, but yeah, um, pretty good looking figure. Um, yeah, and I don't like the beast mode. His uh, those front legs are. Yeah, <laughs> they just scream cheap, but they do have the opening mouth, and he just looks like he's got rabies. But it's a good looking figure, <laughs> legend size. Um, so yeah, you might want to pick this up if you collect those to go at your Beast Wars collection. Next is the Bumblebee. We've seen this one already. And yeah, the Bumblebee looks good. He's got the double stinger weapons, clear plastic people complain about, but that clear plastic and the two two piece plastic looks good. Um, posability. I think we're going to see some mods where we can do a head swap and we might be able to put like a G1 head on him. Um, but it, it is, is, this is good. I mean, so far, so good. Uh, United is amazing. Um, the Bumblebee looks nice. Let's take a look at the car mode. Jeez, this is like, it, it just looks like a cartoon, man. It does look like a cartoon, man. Wow. Wow, that thing looked good, boy. Ooh, hoo, hoo. And it's going to be tight. I might not be able to get toys, but I'll try to do as many news videos as I can. I got to, you know, got to feed kids and things like that. And, you know, with only having, you know, a certain amount of money, I've been used to. I gotta fit all the bills now. So we'll catch up and get everything back. The next thing we got is the uh what is his name? What is his name? That's Boulder Crash, Megatron, you see? Uh Chase. So and when I saw Chase, I was like, does Chase mean like a Chase beast? No, his name is Chase. He wrote well, yeah, the uh got he, he's a go bot. Well, technically, is I have to explain that, but yeah. There, I think he's one. Of, uh, no, he's from the play school. The, the, not play school. The, uh, one of them, the, 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 the little kid ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But wow, they gave him an update. I'm not gonna lie, I like this one. I like this one. It's like he looks like Soundwave with in vehicle, with it, but it turns into like a vehicle. You know what I'm saying? It's like a, a a modified police car. I think that's pretty neat. I think that's pretty neat, and it does look good. Um, yeah. United, you're doing your thing so far. You're doing your thing so far. Next is the Rock Lord. 
Somebody say, rock, Lord, Boulder Crash. A Boulder Crash is a uh, weaponizer or whatever. What it core, core, uh, what it, you could split them apart and he can attach. So he turns into a truck, but he's rocky, I guess. It's an interesting design, but I don't like that waist. That is weird. Looks like he got like one of those like um girdles or something. But the car mode is interesting. He's like a rocky car. Like, you know, I would have preferred he turned into just a plain old rock, but you know, you know Hasbro gotta gotta do their thing. And you know, I think you could pull him apart. And um, you know, he's got this big giant weapon. But yeah, he comes apart. I don't know why I don't have the picks. Next is Windblade. And I know Windblade has gone through some changes over the years. I still have my Legends Windblade with the Target Master, which is worth boatloads of money. I have two copies of the original, sealed and packaged, but from you know the original 330. But I, I, that figure always gives me makes me mad. So now they made this. Um, I wonder if we're gonna get the uh, female seeker um, out of this mold like they did when they did it with the um, original Windblade. Um, so yeah, that'll be that'll be pretty cool. But yeah, yeah. Definitely modern uptake, better articulation, able to uh, stand up on its own. But still, though, I'll never forget that sword that uh, the original Throne 30 had was interchangeable. Uh, amazing. But yeah, I like it. I like it. I want it. I'm going to get it. Next, we got Thundertron. Interesting design from the original. But he still looks, got that old school look. Wow. Wow. He looks good too. I like him. He almost reminds me of a Gundam from like um Yeah, he does remind me of Gundam a little bit. He does. Um he's got the sword, he's got the bearded look. He's got that, you know, they're supposed to do the piracy. I think they're supposed to do the pirate thing. Also remember he was repainted into a version of Leo Convoy. And if I'm not mistaken, was he repainted in the Alpha Trion as well? Something like that? I think so. But anyway. Um, he looks good. This one is on my radar because I know we're going to get more repaints. Probably Alpha Trion. Probably, um, uh, but he did like a Leo Convoy from it. But yeah, looks good. Looks good. Looks good. Now what's next? We got the animated version of Optimus Prime Voyager class. Better picks. I like these. He doesn't look cheap. He looks good. He looks good. He looks like the original, but better. And that's what you want. The face sculpt, amazing. The axe can extend. The, uh, just the shit. I, I love this thing. I was looking at these pictures and I was looking at it on the, the postcard thing. I was like, yes, I'm buying this one. And he turns into the ugly, weird looking truck. But still, I like it because it's just so, it's, excuse me, it's just so weird looking. But it's weird looking in a good way. I've always been love hate for animated more on the love side because season three was a very good season. And there he is, of course, in package. And I love what he looks in package, man. Can't wait to get him. Now we got Tiger Hawk, which I heard is now sold out. Um, he looks good. I can't. I'm trying. I'm gonna have to watch the anime because I know the colors are different. His colors remind me of the RX 93. Uh, the new Gundam, um, the high new Gundam, actually, because in some instances they make the high new Gundam blue, and sometimes they make it white and purple. And he does look like that, and that looks good. Um, yeah, um, he, the, yeah, man, he got merged by the box with Air Razor. Um, so does that mean we're gonna get a silver boat? Hmm, maybe. Um, no, I mean Tigertron. Oh my God, my, what am I doing? We got Tigertron. So we got that. So yeah, we good. We got, why I say silver bullet? I don't know. I don't know either, man. I don't know what's something wrong with me, man. Y'all boy, I'm going through some things right now. I'm tired. I'm not editing this back. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not. So United looks so far to be promising. Um, it kind of makes me think of when we went. It, it, it's good. It's not Siege good. Siege still to me was surprised, like the surprise of the year. But yeah, if United continues down this path, I see us continuing to you you know buy transformers as far as me buying transformers i'm not gonna be buying anything right now um 
you know, my divorce is, it, it's going to happen. We're not going, we're never getting back together. And I, I'm, I, I, I'll say this, I miss her and I love her, but it is what it is. We have to move on and we will. Um, but yeah, I want this. And, um, you know, once I get everything reorganized, I'll be able to do reviews, but I have something coming soon. Super Robot, I bring you no news reviews today. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye.